Alright, chat, so y'all know why we here today, man. Um, first, first, appreciate all the support, all the new subs, man. I love y'all niggas, man. I, 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 I love y'all. Before I get into the sample brand, all that, first, I want to just make these quick little disclaimers. I didn't really disclaimers, but like a build up of how like everything we got to this point. So I said back in like, I started like 2023, I was going to start a brand. Being 100%, I did not start like, I was so focused on trying to get content out, Twitch. YouTube trying to get monetized that I didn't put my primary focus on a brand. You feel me? Cause I feel like I I I, I see people that have brands. It's like maintaining brand content. It's a lot, but it's all possible at the end of the day. So it was just that I wasn't in the right headspace for a brand. I'm not gonna lie. It would have been too much. You gotta pay hello. You feel me? I wasn't just. It wasn't. I wasn't really fully committed. I would say so. Randomly, I got a message from a manufacturer. The manufacturer that I have currently now cool dude great dude we got chemistry already randomly he takes me on instagram and i'm like when i get dms like that you know how it's like random pages dm you talking about some dm for work i have are you looking for a manufacturer i'm like i went to his page he had like a good amount of following i seen he actually had like work on his page in the factory all that stuff so i'm like i'm not looking to start a brand right now but you feel me it could always come in mind when i do start this was and mind you this was all in 2023 by the way so i'm gonna be honest with y'all bro i am not like the top tier most design like i don't know how to really i don't got the best ideas when it comes to designs or anything like that like i'm gonna say i was scared to start but i'll be like some i'm not even scared to start but like be sometimes i don't want to show my ideas because like some people actually might look at me like a fashion nigga because like i actually like clothes i enjoy clothes so if i come out throw some shitty shit it's gonna be like this nigga's a fake fashion nigga even though i don't want to be like i'm not a fashion nigga but i just like clothes put on clothes and that's it bro but um i have to get out that mind space of so i just trial and error but i will admit though i'm not the best designer like i just like clothes and want to start making clothes don't fuck it up i know how to put pieces together but visually designs all that took some time but i'll say i'm a lot better now than i was before so end of probably like november december 2023 I was working on this hoodie design that I'm about to show y'all. Working on a hoodie design. Took some time. I didn't even know what G I didn't know what GSM was. I didn't know what material to use. So it was just a long process of trial and error and just learning different stuff out. But I'm glad I went through that because it's like I know what I don't know. And I still have a lot more to learn, but I know a lot more than I did before. All about progression. It's all that really matters in this shit. So and I think he sent me like some different materials so I know what's what and what I can do next time. That's why I said me and him got great chemistry, bro. He sent me out free material so I can know like what kind of fleece is, what all that shit is. So you know, we open it up. Okay. So this is a big ass moment, bro. Let me set up. <laughs> I'll be good. Box cutters. But he feels a lot thicker in person. So, I mean, you know what I'm saying? <laughs> <laughs> Alright, let me see. But another thing I have to mention too before I show you the hoodie, so I'm not gonna lie. Um the first sample that he made, he it was like a misunderstanding. Y'all I'm gonna show I'm gonna pop up the tick packs, so y'all gonna see the difference, but they had to remake a new hoodie and this is the one that it is right here. So if it doesn't look exactly how the tech pack looks, that's how it's supposed to look. But again, misunderstanding stuff happened. So if it looks a little bit off or different compared to again the tech pack, y'all know why. But um, it's just some small details that I liked. But a little bit more about this one compared to the one I had in a previous tech pack. But yeah, I put a note here too. I'm gonna read the note first. All right, yeah, you know what I'm saying. First of all, apology for the delay, brother. I told you this, is my guy. It's my guy. I assure you this would never happen again. I hope you'll like this. Abdul. That's his name, by the way. That's my main factory name. Abdul. Cool dude, like I said. But again, like I had told you, hoodie had got messed up, so I had got delayed back. It was supposed to I was supposed to get this like a minute ago, but again, hoodie got messed up, had to remake it, so that's why he said uh the delay. But it's cool though. Feel me? I'm a end of the day. It's all love. That's how the tennis happened. Here go the material he sent me out, so Oh, these are like just different different GSMs, but I ain't gonna go through all these. I'ma just that's for you know like he just more than he just sent me out material to look at. Like I ain't about to go through every material there is, but I'm glad he sent me these out. But what I will show y'all is he sent out. All right, so here you go. He sent out some of the. I feel like I got some of the best tags in the game to be honest. You know what I'm saying like some of the best tags in the game to be honest. First thing that I already noticed about this is GSM. I need I need to use a way thicker GSM because it does feel kind of lightweight. Like again, that's my fault. I didn't know anything about GSM. You can already tell by just looking at this, but this hoodie compared to this hoodie, this is a lot more thicker, a lot more heavier. This is more like lightweight. You can tell that just by me holding them, but I feel like this hoodie has a lot of potential. That's why I'm probably gonna do something better later on down the road, but this logo, the logo right here, it's puff printed, venture right there, puff printed. I kind of was 
then want to really do puff print because the puff print is like overused a lot. Manufacturer recommended it, so I'm like, why not? It looks good. Like, like I said, it's a lot of things that could be changed in this. These little lines, of like extra layer that y'all see throughout the hoodie, I got this from the brand Earl. I fuck with that shit. I like how it's like it adds more detail. And this is another thing I meant to say. More throughout my clothes, I don't like doing a minimal, the minimalistic thing where it's just like it's settled, calm, which is still cool. I'm not saying if you do that, it's bad. But me personally, I want to go be different overall expand and just try different things like this whole point of this brand shit to just make clothes in our liking you know obviously i'm not going to spam distressing or goddamn puff print on a hoodie but or whatever it is but i'm gonna add more out of the ordinary of my liking like, i feel like everything every piece like every this whole thing is from my likings of what i like i'm not just going everything that i drop will be from my liking anything that i like will be put on my pieces so that's just another little factor right there but shout out earl for the inspo i like that crazy and then if y'all don't know i am a distressing merchant so i told him to randomly throughout the hoodie add a minor little distressing on it as you can see per periodically around the hoodie see some distressing on it the little line pattern goes from the front all the way to the back and then again more distressing on the back as well and it just adds more to the hoodie to me in my opinion but overall this is a comp hoodie of course i'm gonna keep this but i know a lot now that I need to do differently, like GSM, thicker GSM, what else? It's pretty much just a GSM. And again, this, the little, the lines was supposed to be black. I need to look at the tech back again, but the lines were supposed to be black. And it was supposed to be like, and yeah, the lines weren't even supposed to be this color, but he, you know, he messed up on it, maybe messed up on it a little bit, which I, like I said, it's trial and error. We learn, my bad if I'm yapping y'all, I'm just trying to, this shit crazy, like I really made this shit, like I made this shit. Could be a little bit better for my liking, but it's all trial and error. I'm about to try it on the computer. Yeah, knew no, I won't be home for long. Mama said you always gone. Me that she's that provolone. Bad bitch, she left with lonely. No, she not coming home. Put that bitch on OPM. She geeked up by the mind she gone. What I ride to bunchy hope. Cut up by the whole damn stove. Where the fuck my mind go? Where the fuck my time go? Sleep without my ice on. All right, Charles. So this is the hoodie, though. Pretty much, that's pretty much it. Um, I'm outside. Um, I was gonna show it in my room, but like the lightning, back background, this shit didn't win. It didn't match the vibe. It was ass. I know it was ass. But let me know how y'all feel about it, man. And again, let me tell y'all the reason why I'm probably not gonna drop this. Honestly, I don't think I told y'all, but I plan on doing a summer drop joggers and t and shirts, which I'm already like working on. Right, I'm already working on that designs. Tip pack finna get made for those. So the reason I'm not dropping this is because. By the time I like get production in, cause I'm more than likely gonna do pre-orders. I don't wanna just buy hella shit. I don't know how many people gonna buy my shit, etc. So pre-orders and by the time I like get all that shit made, production, it's probably gonna be around the time of summer. So it's like, what am I dropping hoodies for in the summer? And I wanna do my drops by like season. So like whatever I drop is gonna fit the weather, like I said. So if it's like winter time, hoodies, gloves, hats, whatever I end up dropping, summertime, spring, whenever it's hot, tees, shorts, jorts, whatever I end up making, but all in that categorized. But all in that category, all in the category of weather, you feel me? So that's how I'm just doing my shit, like seasonal drops. But um, yeah, man, let me know how y'all feel about it. honest feedbacks, honest ratings. I know, like I said, this is not like you no know, something I plan on dropping in particular. But this overall design, like the line of distressing coming to the back, I fold with that heavy, I fold with that heavy. And shout out Earl again, cause I got my inspo from Earl with the little line and the, the extra layer of lining on it. So I, I gotta stop being in my head so much, bro. I keep think I, I keep wanting to say a lot of people probably ain't gonna fold with this shit, but. Who knows, bro? So, um, I love y'all. Hope y'all enjoyed this little video. Sample opening with me. A lot more of these to come. I want to document like my whole brand journey, stuff like that. Like I said, I love clothes. I'm into clothes. As y'all can see by my pictures, stuff like that. But I'm be happy right now. I love y'all. Let me know how y'all feel about this. And, baby, on is out, man. Peace. Venture 2024. Trust the process.